I'm Jessica Cartalia with your evening digital news brief for Friday, October 7th. The first football game at Roxborough High School since last week's deadly shooting is canceled due to safety concerns. Roxborough was scheduled to play Kip Dubois Collegiate Academy at 3 o'clock. The team is now scrimmaging against themselves. Kip's football coach tells us that the game was canceled over safety concerns. A tractor trailer slams into a dentist's office in Delaware County. It happened around 1.30 this afternoon on West McDade Boulevard at Morris Avenue in Ridley Township. Officials say a truck driver was cut off by another driver and crashed into the Ridley Dental Center. The dental office was empty. A child in another vehicle was taken to the hospital to be checked out. A teenager is killed after a shootout in Kensington on Palethorpe Street last night. The gun battle Thursday was captured on camera. You can even see a gunman shield himself behind a car. Neighbors were forced to duck for cover in their own homes. Police found a 17-year-old shot multiple times. Investigators say they collected 118 pieces of evidence. Police search for a suspect who sources tell us shot and killed his co-worker near a Philadelphia airport. We're told that the gunman and the 51-year-old male victim are FedEx employees. Sources say that they got into a fight and the suspect shot the victim in a parking lot off Tinicum Island Road. A judge is expected to rule next week on whether to grant an injunction to stop Crozier Health from closing Delaware County Memorial Hospital. The judge heard arguments today from the Foundation for Delaware County. The organization says the hospital's owner prospect is breaking a commitment to operate Delaware County Memorial Hospital until at least July of 2026. You can always get the latest on these stories and more on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for the evening digital brief. I'm Jessica Cartalia.